Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you have not seen my other videos, then welcome. Um, so I am doing another unboxing today. I know I said that I wasn't going to do unboxings after unboxings, and I was only gonna unbox ones that I was going to work on, and that is still true. If that's my plan. Um, I'm unboxing this for my daughter. So I did buy this kit and my daughter wants to try diamond painting. And so I definitely told her, you know, she should start with a round. I had this, she went through Diamond Art Club and she picked this one and I, I happen to have it in my stock. So my stash. So I, I'm going to give it to her to give it a try. So this is um, Afternoon Tea by Randall Spangler. So let's go in it. So again, this is Diamond Art Club. If you're familiar with them, you know that the pink circle means that they're round diamonds. If they're square diamonds, it would have a blue square. And then they have the pink foil around the box. On the back, it has the kit contents and how it works, how to do the diamond painting. So let's open it. Okay, we have one of their older tool kits. They are putting new tool kits. I have not received one yet, but they are gonna be putting new tool kits in all of their kits. Uh, they're making the transition now, and uh, I've seen them on videos, so I know that this is not the new one. And I have opened this kit before in unboxings, so I'm just gonna go ahead and dump everything out of there. So they give you a pen to start, a blue pen with a blue squishy, and a four place multi-placer. We have two pieces of the Diamond Art Club uh, heart wax, which is really good stuff. I um, tested a piece of wax from another kit and I like this stuff better. We have a basic tray with a funnel and a lot of baggies. This one has a ton of baggies, look at this. So that's great. You can use baggies to kit up in. I use them to kit down in and save my extra diamonds. So, okay. Inside the box, we also have a small sticker. And a lot of people use this if they store their diamond paintings flat down in a closet they'll put this on the end so that you know which one is in each box and they don't have to pull all the boxes out and look at the front or you can use it in a journal or whatever so i'm going to put this to the side I'll put the toolkit to the side so there was no tweezers in this toolkit and that's because diamond art club only gives you the pointy tweezers and they look like this if you are doing a square painting. So no tweezers for the rounds. It comes in this dust cover. Okay. So this, I am currently working on, I did an unboxing for Fairy Tale Dreams by Randall Spangler. And I believe this one's bigger than that. So here's the drills. And inside the canvas, they have the drills that are packaged like this. They are not individually bagged, so you do have to cut them apart and place them either in the baggies, if that's how you're going to kit up, or um, in the containers that you're going to kit up in. It also has a sticker that says afternoon tea. So if you are a person who maybe hangs your, your canvases and stores the drills separately, you'll know exactly what drills go with what canvases. We have um, the step-by-step -step instructions. Apparently they uh, revamped this as well. There's a newer one I haven't seen yet. I think that's what I heard. Uh, they also give you a large, this whole thing is a sticker. And it has a start and end date, so you can put this in a journal. It tells you the shape of your diamond, um, 
and then the size. So this is a 56 centimeter by a 69 centimeter. And again, the name of the artwork and the artist by Randall Spangler. So this is Diamond Art Club only sells licensed artwork. So that, I'm new to all of this, but that is pretty important to me because I do believe that everyone should get credit for their work. Uh, and, and that includes in art. No one should just take someone's work and make money off of it and the artists not get paid. I think that's horrible. So I will only be showing licensed artwork. Um, we also have the legend here, and these are individual stickers that you can put it either on the bags, if that's how you're kitting up, or on the containers, if that's how you're kitting up. This kit has 50 colors, and it has three ABs. So ABs are Aurora Borealis um, diamonds. And you can tell because Diamond Art Club, they number them below 150. So the DMC codes are on the side here next to the symbols and they start at 150. Anything below 150 is gonna be an AB drill. Now the AB drills, they have an iridescent coating on them and, and we'll get into that soon. So we have, at 134, 138, and 141, which are going to be our AB drills. It looks like a green, a blue, and probably an off-white. So we'll look at them in a minute. All right, let's open the canvas. I'm just going to roll this back. So the canvas is a velvety backing. It's very soft and pliable. You can roll this back because all of Diamond Art Club's canvases are poured glue. If you had um, a double-sided adhesive, you would not be rolling this back like this. I have not worked on a double-sided adhesive, but I heard it does bad things. Um, and you can see that we have the scalloped edges and the poked holes to keep it from fraying. On the canvas on the front, we have Again, afternoon tea, the size 56 centimeters by 69 centimeters and copyrighted by Randall Spangler made by Diamond Art Club. So that's nice. Look at this, this is so cute. Oh, I love this cup too. My husband said, when he first saw the one I'm doing, he said, oh, it's a frog. I said, I'm like, it's not a frog, it's a dragon. He said, no, it's a little alligator. <laughs> But I think he's so cute. Okay, and so we have the legend, again, 50 colors on each side of the canvas. If you have to refer to that while you're actually doing the painting. And this is a good size. I don't know, is this bigger? So the one I'm doing is 71 by 41, and this is 56 by 69. So this is slightly bigger than the one I'm tackling now. But look how beautiful it is. Okay, I'm gonna pull this up and you can see that these symbols are very clear. Love that. Okay, so let's look at the drills. And I'm loving the one I'm doing so far. It is so colorful. I love all the colors. And look at this. Look at this. Look at all these great colors. These pinks and blues and purples, greens, and you've got some kind of peachy color in here. So I'm not gonna, sometimes I do this and sometimes I don't, but I'm not gonna go over every color. I'm just going to show them to you, and you can see they have great shimmer. Even the ones that aren't ABs, they have great shimmer in there. So there are two bags of the 648, which is like an off-white, it looks like to me. Two bags of the 3371 brown. Okay, and here's our first AB. So it is the white AB 141. I don't have any natural light. This is nighttime for me. 
So I don't know if you can see that iridescent coating or not this time. Some beautiful colors. I love this very pale pink here. So you can tell these bags there's less. I love this like purple bluish indigo. We have less of these colors here. We've got baby blue, another blue, rose, another pale pink. Okay, and here's our other ABs. We have 134, so this is the green AB, and then 138, the blue AB. So pretty. I don't know if you can see that. Okay. And then the last set of colors. So remember, we have 50 of them. So now we're getting into like mauve. This is like a very pale sage, maybe. Some reds, dark green, more pinks, maroon. Sorry for all the crinkling. And so we do have some three tens, two bags of three tens. So let's see where we're going with this. Okay. So the three tens we can see are outlining the dragon here, doing some outline work, and then in the background up here. That's not bad. It looks like we have a decent amount of color blocking in this painting. And we can see where the A Bs are. So one is this bright green and you can see it's all through the dragon in his face that's going to look so good and some in the leaves up here and then the two okay you can see it here in the cup in the sky in the cup some more over here in the sky um, some in here it's really all where I see the two. The two bag was little. And then our third AB is three. It's a white three. So oh, this string, that's going to be cool, is AB. And then here in the cup, outlining the cup. So we have some ABs all in this cup. Any in the star? Some in the star. In his eyes. This is going to be beautiful. Can't wait to see her finish this. So, yeah, that is Afternoon Tea by Randall Spangler. So, hopefully I'll be doing a post-review of this event, this soon, eventually. If she likes it, I hope she likes it. So, I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please hit subscribe. And I will be posting more videos. Thank you. Peace.